God wants you to be happy because He loves you. Hi, my name is J. Paul Hernandez. This is SMDC, The Good Word. I'm a dad and I love my son so much. But there are times when he's a bit naughty and I need to scold him and correct him. But even if I do this, I still want him to be happy. Why? Because I love him so much. So imagine this. Your heavenly Father, your perfect Father, your perfect parent, our God, who loves you so much, He wants you to be happy. When you're crying, when you're hurting, when you're broken, when you're anxious, when you're worried, when you're frustrated, God wants you to be happy because He loves you. Let me tell you a story. I have a friend, his name is Bruno. He allowed all of his friends to step on him. He allowed his boss for four years to verbally abuse him, take credit for his work, and then steal stuff from him, and then just, you know, not pay his overtime. Crazy, right? And Bruno would allow this. Why? Because this was his mindset. He allowed things or allowed people to step on him from, from when he was small until he was older. Why? Because this is what he thought he deserved. My dear friends, you accept the love that you think you deserve. Here are three reminders why God wants you to be happy. Number one, you are not an accident. From Psalm 139 verse 13, it says, You made all the delicate inner parts of my body and knit them together in my mother's womb. I know someone, very beautiful girl, but always falls for the wrong guy, a guy that cheats on her, sometimes even as money and allowance from her. Why? Because she thinks that she deserves it. She grew up with a broken family that forgot about her. Her parents remarried and just left her to an aunt. And she felt like an accident. But here's just want to tell you, if you're breathing, you're not an accident. If you're alive, you're not an accident. If you're watching this video right now, you are not an accident. Second reminder, you are unique. Psalm 139 verse 14 says, Thank you for making me wonderfully complex. It is amazing to think about. Your workmanship is marvelous how well I know it. What am I saying? Or what is God telling you right now? You are unique because when God made you, He threw away the mold. You are handcrafted in your mother's womb. There's no one else like you. Third reminder that God wants you to be happy. You are loved totally, completely, and perfectly. Here's another Psalm from 139 verse 15 to 16. You were there while I was being formed in utter seclusion. You saw me before I was born and each day of my life before I began to breathe. Every day was recorded in your book. Who are you? I want to repeat to you, you are God's child. You are His beloved, not the least. You are His favorite. I know it sounds crazy because all your life, you might, been, you might have been thinking, I'm not good enough. I'm, I'm just this. No. Because you are God's child, you are amazing, and you deserve to be happy. So starting today, say this with me. I want to be happy. Put on the comment section, I want to be happy. I'm going to be happy. I'm happy. So when you wake up in the morning, say this with me. This is going to be a happy day. Before you sleep, thank you, Lord, for this happy day. Just think of happy thoughts because you are God's child and He wants you to be happy. And your heavenly Father loves you so much and He wants you to be happy even if life is not perfect. If you want more videos, click like and subscribe to this channel.